This video is sponsored by Unolis.com. Guys, um, so we got a problem. We got uh, a bunch of these chipmunks that are just killing my tomato plants, just biting them off. I just keep throwing them out. And now it started going off from my potato plants too. So yeah i gotta cast this guy and kill him basically drown him so we're gonna build a uh, trap for it i uh, a friend of mine told me how to do that so i'm just gonna try see if it works so it's just a simple bucket method probably you guys have seen it somewhere else but uh it works really well according to other people i haven't tried it myself so let's see how it works you can see the holes that uh chipmunk made look at this it's just like um big holes everywhere in my uh strawberry patch um, yeah. guys uh, we're just going to use this um, the bucket it's just a, the old mudding bucket that I have you don't need anything fancy and uh, just make sure this is this is, has to be at least uh, I don't know 18, 18 inches or so this bucket height so we just need something deep like this uh, a bucket so I'm just going to use an old one um, that still got some mud in it which is fine it doesn't need to be uh, new or anything so and we're going to use a, a piece of wood a scrap piece of wood and uh we're going to put two screws in here uh, like that one here and one here and um so let's make it yeah um i mean if you don't have any screws just use a long nail i mean any anything that just two of them would be enough you, you don't need a, uh, a screw okay Okay, none of this needs to be perfect. Just make sure that two screws like this. The plan is that you got two, two screws like this, right? So we're gonna put put it on a bucket like that, just so that it doesn't come out when something gets on it. So that that's the plan. So that's about it. So so trap is almost ready. Uh, just fill it to three quarters of the bucket. Okay, right, so we, we, we you know with this we, we built this uh, a piece of wood with two screws, right? So we're gonna put it on here. So the bucket is uh, three quarters filled uh, with water, and uh, we're just gonna lean it on like that so that it doesn't fall off. That's why we put those screws on there, and just uh, let the wood piece lie around and um, on the floor on the ground. So. So we picked up this uh, bird seed from Walmart. It's it's mainly um, sunflower seeds, black sunflower seeds. So we're gonna use these sunflower seeds as a bait. So we used to uh, put these seed in our bird feeder, and uh, chipmunks and squirrels used to eat them. So let's try if this works as a trap, as a bait. I mean. Yeah, put just enough so that it covers the water surface. So the plan is that it's just going to climb on this piece of wood and look at those seeds and it's just, just fall into it, trying to catch those, trying to get those uh, seeds. So let's see if it works. Guys, we built this uh, trap like five minutes ago and uh, we already caught the chipmunk, one of them. He fell in. Um, let's see if it moves around. He was moving around a bit ago. Chipmunk. It, uh, yeah, this was a menace. It was eating my plants and causing a lot of damage. It's done. So. You only took five minutes to build and it didn't take very long for it to. You didn't get trapped in there. So that's it. All right, we, we, uh, since this morning, we, in the morning we already caught one and uh, two more chipmunks fell into the, this uh, trap. So 
It's working great. Yeah, I, I thought uh, we caught only two, but since this morning, we caught four. One in the morning and three now. It looks like this thing pretty much got most of the chipmunks around here. All right, this is the fifth guy today we bought. Uh, we, uh, this is the fifth chipmunk that fell into our trap that we built this morning. So, and this guy is a fatty. Oh, this guy is fat. Oh my God. Yeah, the, we, we thought it was uh, only we caught five. We actually caught six of these chipmunks today. <clears throat> I can't believe this thing. Um, yesterday we built this, so. I mean, it caught six chipmunks yesterday, this trap. It took like five minutes to build it. And then I left it overnight and there's not much seed in there. And it still caught a bunch of my mice that fell in there. So we got a lot of problems with mice too. So it's taking care of mice also along with chipmunks. Let's see how many we got. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, see, it got two mouses fell in there. <laughs> 